John, back to you. All right, Alex, thank you. Today we are hearing stories of survival and courage from concert goers in Las Vegas, including some with ties to Southern Arizona. News 4 Tucson's Aliyah Shahid has that story. Concert goer Richard Bernardo captured this harrowing video. The veteran and Tucson native says at first he thought the popping sound was fireworks, but quickly realized something was very wrong. I've been through Fort Hood mass shooting and, uh, you know, firefights in Iraq, so that's what it sounded like. That was definitely uh, gunfire, you know, it was an automatic weapon going off. Bernardo and his wife were able to escape uninjured, but the gravity of what they've been through is still sinking in. My wife's still playing in her head, trying to make sense of it. I don't think we'll ever understand what goes through these guys' minds. It's pissing me off that idiots like this do this stuff. Former Tucsonan Shanda Maloney wasn't at the concert, but she heard the sirens from her home in Vegas and jumped into action to give free rides to people stranded near the strip. These people are tourists, so they don't know where they're going. You know, maybe they, they started running away from Mandalay Bay, but that's where they were staying. If I could get there and just get people to safety, that's what I was going to do. She's one of hundreds who lined up to donate blood, and she's asking others to do what they can to help Las Vegas recover. You know, if anybody can, you know, donate blood, donate their time, donate money, we'll take it. Aliyah Shahid, News